G'day, Glenn Morris here from the Smart Energy Lab. Today, I'm out in the open with the Fox ESS system here. We installed this a few weeks ago, but I've been testing it and uh, also been using it. This actually runs part of the Smart Energy Lab, which is pretty cool. Something I'm really impressed by is how Fox ESS respond to suggestions and also to compliance requirements. So here in Australia, one thing that catches out a lot, particularly uh, companies that make hybrid inverters and separate battery systems, is that our standard ASNZ uh, 5139 actually requires that all of the high voltage, or I should say above uh, 60 volts DC, which is uh, DVC B or C cables coming from a battery need mechanical protection completely. Not just, there's no 300 mil exemption rule like there is for PV, for PV array cables, for batteries, all of it has to be mechanically protected. So in response, Fox ESS made a cover to go over their plug and socket connections, made a cover for the inverter, so all the terminals are mechanically protected. That's the kind of response I like to see from a company who understands the Australian market. That's really cool. Now, what else do I like about this unit? Well, this is the uh, 15 kilowatt. We actually had the eight kilowatt hybrid unit. This is the 15 kilowatt hybrid unit. Uh, it's actually, like I said, running part of the Smart Energy Lab. In fact, my editing suite, and it's important that I have no interruption to power. So this is great because it provides me with complete backup. The battery stack here is super impressive for its compactness. Now look, 1.3 meters tall, I'm not very big, right? Um, that is 41 kilowatt hours of storage in this tiny footprint. That's great if you happen to be interested in the Cheaper Home Batteries program because <laughs> you want to get as close to 50 kilowatt hours as you can if you really want to max out that rebate. But for 41 kilowatt hours, <laughs> that's a lot of storage. Uh, these inverters can do VPP, of course, so that battery can make you money, especially when you combine it with an agent who provides the VPP functionality. Uh, that's another benefit. Uh, the, the way these work, by the way, is each battery module clips onto the next one. There is no cables, so it's super quick to install. Now, you'll see in a minute. Uh, and the top unit contains the BMS, uh, also on the other side, a double-poled DC breaker, so it's got built-in isolation and overcurrent protection on the battery itself. So that's awesome. The, the comms to the unit goes to the inverter, so it's a managed battery, which means it can run uh, at its optimum efficiency. And efficiency is one of the things that uh, Fox is really, uh, ESS is really keen on. Uh, when they say the capacity of these battery modules, these are the EQ4800s, uh, they're at 4.8 kilowatt hours each, 100% usable. We're not talking, you know, magic numbers where you can only use so much of it. It's 100% usable. So when you're claiming a rebate, it's the usable capacity that matters. So that is really impressive. They also provide all the other regulatory information, things like the safety data sheet, uh, something that's often poorly complied with. People forget that you need a safety data sheet. Uh, we make custom shutdown procedures because every installation is slightly different and put it in a document holder. Now, you're probably wondering where the other signage is at the moment because I'm a bit of a geek on getting your signage done nicely. Uh, we still haven't finished the signage on this unit. So apologies, that might even be a follow-up. So uh, there you go, the uh, Fox ESS. Uh, this is the hybrid unit, the 15 kilowatt. Oh, I forgot one thing built-in Wi-Fi. There's no dongle. There's no horrible dongle that's going to wobble in the wind and break off. There's a little stub antenna. You can't see it because it's under here. It's about this tall. And you just screw the stub antenna in and now you've got Wi-Fi. So really tidy, uh, uh, much better in terms of um, you know, durability. Uh, so Fox, once again, try to put everything in the box. So just sit back and enjoy a time-lapse of the installation of the Fox ESS H3 Hybrid.
So, thanks FoxySS for sending us this to check out at the lab. See ya.